hello my weekend family welcome to our channel today we are going to be cooking something special and guess what this is a typical Cameroonian delicacy conjure we have our plantain right here this is about nine plantains we have um our goat meat smoked and then we have we have celery like two of this we have about half half leek and we have a full big red onion, two habanero pepper. You can put more depending on how hot you want your food to be. We have thyme. This is a teaspoon of thyme. This is a quarter spoon of um, black pepper. You can use half, that's okay. But I choose to use um, a quarter. And here we have a teaspoon of country onion. I guess you know what country onion is. They call it rondel in French. And here we have ginger, we have garlic, we have our white pepper. This is about a teaspoon and a half of white pepper. We have a bay leaf here. We have um we have this other spice here. We call it bebe. I don't really know the English name. And we have this other one. I only know the name in French, which is Clou de giraffe or something glove, something like that. Yeah, and we will be using salt and my ghee. I'll be using this one particularly. Togo, you can't find it here except if you want someone to send it um, from Cameroon. We have our vegetable oil, so let's go ahead and start our cooking. So, guys, our oil is hot enough. We'll go ahead and pour in our onions. We allow it to get um, cooked a little bit, just a little, not too much, because it's still going to cook in the food. It's just to get that onion um, sinks in the oil. Okay, fam, our onion is cooked enough. We'll go ahead and put in our goat meat and then stir it. I think the oil has been well flavored with the onion enough so we'll go ahead and stir the goat meat in the oil and the onion so we put in a little bit of salt well yeah and then a cup of water and let it cook for about 15 minutes this is goat meat you can use any meat of your choice i don't know how soft you like your meat to be but um if you, if this was beef i would have put the, the the beef and then immediately put in the plantain but because this is goat meat and it's hard to cook i'll let it cook for 15 minutes before i put in the plantain so so while our meat is cooking i will immediately go ahead and blend our spices i actually put everything i showed you earlier except for the bay leaves yeah so we're going to put this um when we put the plantain in the pot okay fam welcome back it's been exactly 15 minutes and this is how our meat looks like Mm. yep so we are going to go ahead and put in our plantain as you see i um divided the plantain into two because i just like it to be this size but traditionally we usually cook it like the normal size without cutting it just the full plantain you pour it in there and then you mix it okay fam our plantain is thoroughly mixed as you can see i still allow the meat to be under because i really like my meat to be soft so i'll go ahead and put in a cup of water maybe so this is the second cup of water yeah and then i'll cover the pot and let it cook again for about 15 minutes and after those 15 minutes i'll go ahead and put in our spice in any other thing that's left 
after 15 minutes this is how our pot looks like as you can all see the planting is kind of soft not like done but it's soft though so just tear it up i'll go ahead and put in a bay leaf right there and pour our spices yeah so i'll put a little bit of water about two more cups of water and put in our maggi so fam i'm going to put in our oil now because i don't eat too much of oil i'll put in about a quarter cup of oil maybe a cup so the reason why i'm putting it now and not after is because i really want it to get into the plantain so after testing it i saw this okay and my gaze okay everything is top notch we're going to cover the pot now for it would it had it would take an hour to properly cook like to cook perfectly yes even if the plantain gets soft um before that uh, that one hour we still have to leave it there for an hour it has to make exactly one hour i'll go ahead and cover our pot now but you have to be checking um to make sure that your pot doesn't get burned okay my people this is our pot exactly an hour after and guess what i did not add any more water um after the last time um after covering the pot i didn't add any water i just i was just checking and everything was just fine it's, this is after exactly an hour and then for the spices go ahead tell me um what did i not put in the conjure that you think um has to be there so for this recipe the spices i showed you is the these are the easiest spice to get wherever you are certainly there are other spices you could add in there like the quatre côté the four corners but i don't have it but guess what it doesn't even feel like this it's missing that it's exactly the way it tastes exactly the way um conjure should taste so if i'm going ahead try this recipe tell me how yours came out this is mine as you can see i forgot to tell you but i used smoked goat meat and this is just ah uh, i'm i'm ready to dive in there and um start eating that is the final result my people oh my god you see why i put the oil like so that when you cut the plantain you can see the oil coming out from it as you can see right there oh my god this is so good <laughs> this is so good let me taste this first mm. Mm, mm, mm. i have to try this oh my god and it's too hot mm. so guys enjoy guys enjoy this recipe Tell me how yours came out and um, no, just, just, just leave a comment. Have a great weekend. God bless you. Peace.